When you are looking for a compact, beginner-friendly drone that packs the most essential features to make your drone flying experience amazing, you can only turn your head to DJI. To be more specific, it's their most popular mini-series. The Mini 4 Pro is the most recent offering, which was announced roughly six months ago. But let's be honest, the Mini 4 could not live up to its expectations, and the not-so-significant upgrades that it got in no way make the $150 price bump justifiable. Hence, there is already a wish list from fans that they would love to see in the upcoming Mini 5 Pro. In today's video, we will be discussing how DJI can bring back glory to its mini-series, and also its release window. Now, don't get us wrong, the Mini 4 is a great drone overall. You get a high-quality camera with 4K resolution and great flight time. However, you will find most features almost identical to its predecessor. The only noteworthy upgrades were an additional sensor for obstacle avoidance and the inclusion of OQSync 4, which offers more transmission range. So there's not much point in spending 200 bucks more just for some more kilometers of transmission range. Starting with a must-have upgrade for the Mini 5 Pro is a larger image sensor, providing more resolution with a better dynamic range. Both the Mini 3 and Mini 4 Pro feature a one-first 3-inch CMOS sensor offering 4K footage, though you get some extra frames per second for filming with the Mini 4. A smaller sensor limits the overall capability of the camera. What's a bit of a shock is that DJI has used a similar sensor for their Air 3 as well, downgrading from the 1-inch sensor and also sacrificing the resolution. So to improve the overall image quality, the DJI Mini 5 Pro is expected to come up with a 1-inch sensor, allowing you to capture stunning 4K images at up to 120 frames per second. With the larger sensor, you will have the advantage of shooting low-light images with less noise and more visibility due to more light getting inside the sensor. But what's more troublesome is the less internal storage. Having only 2 gigabytes of space, DJI needs to upgrade the internal storage to at least 8 gigabytes so that the drone doesn't have to be brought down now and then to transfer media. Also, the flight time didn't see any upgrade compared to its predecessor, which is always a major concern for a drone pilot. And with the Intelligent Battery Plus, the weight of the drone significantly rises. DJI needs to find an efficient solution to increase the flight time with the regular battery option and offer at least 40 minutes of worry-free flying in the air. So shall we expect the Mini 5 Pro anytime soon? Well, DJI has significantly reduced its R&D period and they are on a roll, launching numerous tech gadgets now and then. We have seen the Mini 4 Pro getting launched just a year after the Mini 3 Pro was introduced. So, keeping that in mind, September 2024 is the most suitable release window for the next-gen Mini 5 Pro. But without the anticipated upgrades, the Mini 5 Pro can't make any impression since the price of the drone has already been increased. You can either spend some more cash and buy the Air 3 that offers double the punch, or spend much less and buy the Mini 3 Pro instead. So, if DJI sticks with the $700 to $800 margin, there's no alternative to a larger sensor, better dynamic range and resolution, and more flight time. Do you think the Mini 5 Pro will be a worthwhile upgrade? What more features would you love to see? Throw all your thoughts in the comments, give this video a thumbs up, and subscribe to our channel to keep yourself updated with all the latest tech news.